food source. Late at night, the pride, hungry and on the prowl, move, cubs and all, to a better location for hunting within their territory. The dry season is well advanced, and the lake has lost nearly all of its water. Crossing the dry lake, the female carries one of her cubs, while two others try to keep up. Somehow the pride passes too close to a herd of buffalo, who try to trample the lions. In a valiant effort to protect the cubs, the lioness dashes at the buffalo, and then runs back to her cubs, trying desperately to guide them to safety. she rushes at the great beasts, but the buffalo will not scatter and continue to charge the lioness and other members of the pride. Dawn finds the savanna calm with no signs of raging buffalo. The pride has sought the shelter of a secluded spot. The only animal now in view is the lioness as she searches for This pride has caught a young calf. Like all cows, Cape Buffalo are herd animals. So mess with one, and you mess with them all. The fearless adults advance. forcing the lions to retreat from a wall of angry beef. This one is lucky to escape with its life. It's too late for the calf, but it isn't over yet. Lions have babies too. Mobs of buffalo have been observed going after lions that have killed a member of their herd. This pride is resting and digesting after a successful hunt. They're blissfully unaware that they're being stalked themselves. The pride contains 10 cubs, too young to know that danger is close by. By the time the adults realize what's going on, it's too late. The buffalo's fury is unleashed on the confused and helpless cubs. Lionesses try desperately to distract the rampaging buffalo. But they're outnumbered and outmuscled. Eventually, the buffalo lose interest, leaving the mothers to call for their cubs. Only seven respond. Three have been lost. The survivors have learned a valuable lesson. Even the king of the jungle should steer away from the world's most dangerous cows.